Welcome to the Dataverse Directory product tour. This video will give you an overview of the Dataverse Directory, which will enable you to quickly view, load, or start working on new data flows for all of your data preparation and analysis needs. Following this tour, you'll be able to navigate around Dataverse Directory and effectively view, manage, and work on your data flows and libraries. So let's get started. The directory view provides a single location of all your data flows and library nodes that have been previously created or imported, as well as giving you quick access to creating or importing new data flows. On the left hand side, you will find the collections panel. This panel lists the various collections available in the directory, such as My Documents, which contains all of the data flows which you created and imported. Dataverse nodes, which contains all of the library nodes which are shipped by Dataverse. And lastly, custom nodes, which contains all of the library nodes which you create as you build up your own library of reusable assets, helping to efficiently build consistent analytic applications. In the middle of the screen, you will find the document list. This section will show you a list of documents in the folder that is selected under the collections panel. When a document is selected in the document list, further information about the document is shown in the details panel. You will find information like the title of the document, when it was created and by who, as well as who and when it was last modified by. In the top left hand corner, you will find the create and import menus. The create menu provides commands for creating your own data flows, which are analytic applications and library nodes, which are reusable assets. The import menu provides commands for importing data flows and library nodes from another instance of Dataverse or from a version of LavaStorm. Moving to the top right hand of the screen, the notification indicator in the header bar will show you the progress of any background tasks you may have running, such as the import of data flows and library nodes. Lastly, if you'd like further information on the directory, you can access the help menu in the top right hand corner. You will find further information on Getting started with Dataverse, Advanced Topics, Help on Nodes, Dataverse Script Help, Link to our Dataverse Online Community, List of Keyboard Shortcuts, and Information about the version of Dataverse you have installed. Thank you for watching this video. If you would like to download a copy of Dataverse, join our online community, or watch more videos like this one, please follow the links below.